10 Most Strange Places Scientists Still Can't Explain Why don't scientists know what happens in the mysterious Bermuda Triangle? Did fairies really make strange patterns in the undergrowth in Namibia? What about the cobra-ridden village in India with no history of snake bites? Here is a list of the 10 most strange places scientists still can't explain, no matter how hard they try. Number 10. Triangle of Death One of the most famous places that evokes a sense of mystery in the world is the Bermuda Triangle. The triangle is about 500,000 square miles big and sits in the Atlantic Ocean between Bermuda, Puerto Rico, and Miami, Florida. Nothing unusual about that just now, right? Well, when you consider that more than 20 planes and 50 ships are said to have mysteriously vanished into thin air or crashed without explanation within it, it really raises questions. Especially as the Bermuda Triangle is one of the only two places on Earth where a compass points to true north rather than magnetic north. If this variation is not compensated for, ships and planes are likely to find themselves far off course. These strange facts have led many to believe that the Triangle is home to the lost city of Atlantis. According to legend, the legendary city relied on special energy crystals that were extremely powerful. The theory goes that these energy crystals are in an altered state of some kind and emit rays that confuse navigation. Of course, the theory about Atlantis being within the triangle is just that. But the fact that scientists have been unable to explain the disappearances of ships and planes and the ruining of navigation has led to the public imagination running wild. Number 9. The Crooked Forest the Crooked Forest is a grove of oddly shaped pine trees located near the town of Greifino, West Pomerania, Poland. This grove of 400 trees was planted in the 1930s and grew with an almost 90 degree bend at their base, making them look like fishing hooks. Nobody is quite sure why the trees have taken on this shape. Some believe that some form of human tool or technique was used to make the trees grow or bend. It has also been speculated that the trees may have been deformed to create naturally curved timber which could then be used in furniture or boat building. Others believe that a snowstorm could have bent the trunks, but there is little evidence of that. The forest was featured on Season 1, Episode 4 of The Unexplained on the History Channel. Number 8. Devil's Tower Devil's Tower, also known as Bear Lodge Butte, is a butte, an isolated hill with vertical sides and a flat top in the Bear Lodge Range district of the Black Hills near Hewlett and Sundance in Crook County, northwestern Wyoming. It rises 1,267 feet above the Belforce River, standing 867 feet from summit to base. The summit is 5,112 feet above sea level. Devil's Tower was the first United States national monument, established on September 24, 1906 by President Theodore Roosevelt. There have been a lot of theories as to how the tower came to form. In the 19th century, there was a belief that it was formed by an igneous intrusion. Whilst modern geologists agreed that it was likely formed by an igneous material, they're not exactly sure how the process took place. Some believe that molten rock composing the tower may not have surfaced. Others are convinced that the tower is all that remains of what once was a large explosive volcano. Number 7. Spinning Ice Discs of Michigan in 2017, a perfectly circular disc was spotted spinning atop a lake in Michigan. Nobody has yet been able to answer why this occurred. A clip emerged of the sheet of ice spinning perpetually, as though someone or something had carved it up with a cutter. Several theories are currently doing the rounds about why this has started happening. The most common explanation is that the discs appear when cold, dense air hits a circular surge of water in a river. As of now, though, there is no definitive answer which has only raised questions, especially when several other ice disks started appearing between 2017 and 2019. Number 6. Lines of Wonder Once, many years ago, it was believed that thousands of geoglyphs scratched into a high desert plateau in Peru were the work of extraterrestrials trying to mark a landing site for their spaceships. However, as time has gone by, it has been accepted that the Nazca Lines are the work of ancient humans. It is believed the lines were etched into the ground between 200 BC and 500 AD. Why and how? Nobody is quite sure. Some scientists believe that they are connected to the Nazca's search for drinking water or that they represent constellations seen in the night sky. Nobody knows how such lines were created without sophisticated engineering tools. Number 5. Fairy Circles 
In the Namib Desert of Namibia, there exists a mysterious circle of vegetation creating a landscape that mathematician Cornelia Tamita described as looking like a polka dot dress. Measuring between 10 and 65 feet in diameter, the circles of barren centered vegetation are not actually the work of fairies. The real cause remains unknown. Some scientists believe that they are created by thirsty plants stretching out for water in an arid location. Others believe that an underground network of termites have munched the vegetation into shape. Number 4. Hills of Chocolate Located in the Bohol province of the Philippines, this geological oddity, as the National Geographic calls it, is a range of even mounds dotted across the province. It has lush vegetation that turns brown during the summer die-off, hence the name. However, nobody is quite clear as to how the mounds came to be. Some myths claim that they were the results of warring and weeping giants. Then there are the scientific theories. One such theory is that the mounds are the result of the weathering of marine limestone. The dissolution of the limestone thousands of years ago was impacted by several factors such as rainfall and erosion. Another theory is that the mounds were once coral reefs that erupted after a geological shift beneath the waters, but nobody is quite sure. Number 3 the Pink Lake. Australia's own Lake Hillier remains a true mystery of science. The Pink Lake resides on one of the 105 islands that make up the Recherche Archipelago. The small salty lake flouts convention, namely in that it looks pink no matter how close you get to it. That includes when it's bottled. Nobody knows why for sure, though as always theories abound. Some claim that the pink is the result of a reaction between the lake's salt and its sodium bicarbonate deposits that bacteria or algae are contributing factors. Number 2. Easter Island This isolated island in the Pacific Ocean was once populated by the Rapa Nui civilization who erected almost a thousand giant stone statues known as the Moai roughly 900 years ago. The figures stand at 13 feet tall and weigh 14 tons apiece. They fascinated European explorers who first landed on the island in 1772 and continue to fascinate people today. However, nobody knows for sure why these structures were created, though some scientists believe they may have been placed as markers of freshwater sources. Number 1. Snake Village There is a small village called Shetpal in Solapur, Maharashtra, India, which has gained a lot of popularity due to its strange affinity towards snakes especially cobras. Every house in the village has a resting place for cobras, with the belief that the local deity Lord Sidheshwar has the power to cure snake bites. The villagers and the snakes appear to have quite the harmonious relationship with the animals regularly visiting residents in their schools or places of work. There are instances of snakes getting involved in the games played by the children as well. As for those who are curious, there have been no recorded incidents of snake bites within the village, something that scientists have found quite intriguing, though whether the same could hold true for a visitor remains to be seen. And there you have it, the 10 most strange places scientists can't explain. There's a lot of wonder out there, and given the age of our planet, it's not surprising that they've not been able to explain everything. So what do you think? Is there a scientific explanation for these things, or are they the work of some other power? Aliens? God? Let us know what you think in the comments.